Rated M for Mature. Hi, this is Diane from Beefhead Videos. This is a message for Mr. Travis Touchdown. Just calling to remind you that you haven't returned one of our rentals. Let's see here. It's um, titled Big German Jugs Collection Number 23. Be sure to return it soon. Have a nice day. Congratulations, Mr. Touchdown. Your registration for the ninth UAA rank is now complete. Thank you very much for your cooperation. In addition, we have faxed you some information about the rankings in case you wish to continue your ascent. As a friendly reminder, there will be a small nominal fee to participate in ranked fights. Thank you for your understanding, and have a nice day. Hey folks, welcome back to No More Heroes. We have more money to work for. I already have enough, but whatever. But before we go out on the town, let's get dressed in something new. Looking good. And we have nothing more in this room, so let's pay a little attention to Jean. Then we'll be ready to head out. Hey girl. All right, we're ready. Let's head out. Now then, since you really did not want to see me drive over here, just warping over to the part-time job center. And our next mission is lawn mowing. Now, I don't really remember precisely where this thing is, so I'm just gonna have to follow the map. I don't feel it drifting while I'm at it. Oh, yeah, this is reckless. Yeah, sorry about your house, person. Luckily for that person, there are no destruction physics in this game. Here we are. Hello there, identical twin person. Yeah, let's see, I totally don't remember how to do this. Okay, I can do that. Alright, let's see how this goes. I'm not expecting a gold here, especially since I've apparently never gotten a gold before on this. Probably because I've only done it once. Yep, this is this is our amazing the game, and that's sharp turning there when you use the Z button. So if you can get the timing down and manipulation and the angle and all that, I'm sure you could get a gold on this, but hell if I'm gonna bother. It's measured by acres, as you can see. Acres are even smaller than the acres in Animal Crossing. Those are pretty dang tiny. Actually, in lieu of uh, this not being very interesting, what happened to the acre system in Animal Crossing? What was wrong with it? I mean, it was in the GameCube one, and then they got rid of it for Wild World, and I'm pretty sure that they didn't have it for any of the others. And I thought it was so convenient in terms of navigation. I like things being organized. I mean, sure, it's not that hard to navigate around an Animal Crossing town, but still. Of course, if anyone who's ever mowed a lawn knows that it's best to like go around the edges and then do like a circular kind of spiral thing. 
But the controls aren't so great here, so I, I kind of have trouble doing that. I should roll with this. Yeah, I'm just having a chill time mowing the lawn. You could be out mowing the lawn in real life, you know. Okay, this couldn't this could have been worse. Yep, silver, I'm alright with that. Alright, so we're here at the assassination agency. For the sake of time, of course. Now, gig number two is also unlocked when you get a gold on the coconut thing. Really it's just a bunch of slashing. I'm gonna try to go for the interesting assassination gigs. Like say kill with wrestling moves only, or batting spree. I th think I'll go for wrestling moves, just because uh, you saw batting twice during the actual mission. May you find your and let's find that, uh, find that gig. And it's ways away. Yeah, uh, you may notice that the sandbox in this game is really, really boring. Like, yeah, this is... It may be meta-commentary about how sandboxes often are extremely boring. But it's, it's pretty boring. I am not good at those those turns there. Maybe because you're not supposed to do that in real life, but mm. well, I could try not boosting, but you know. What kind of loser does that? Alright, here we go at Destroy Stadium. So the fun thing about this, except it's not fun at all, is that Travis pulls out his bean katana, but if you press the A button, nothing happens. So you can't accidentally fail the mission, but, uh, Three, two, you know, it's just one. pointless. See, nothing happening. Anyway, kill with wrestling moves. You gotta stun them with a charged, uh, uh, kick attack, which means hold down B and then release it. If you just try to mash B, it won't work. The animation isn't much different, just a bit slower. So, uh. Yeah. Oh, and there I used my Ibn Katana anyway. Anyway, yeah, that. that confused me for a while. It's actually my second attempt at this, because I didn't actually realize how I was supposed to do that. But yeah, you can automatically stun people with charged kicks like that. So it's not always a kick, because you can uh, set it to high and it'll be a punch instead, which I rarely do. But yeah, like that. I don't think there's any practical difference, except uh, depending on which way people have their weapons pointed. Um, which I don't know how much it really factors in. But yeah, it, it's different. And it's not really something that's actually taught. I mean, I didn't know that, and I've beaten this game three times. Anyway, yeah, uh, good luck getting a decent score on this if you don't know how to automatically stun people. No. Yeah, people will stay stunned for a long time. Not long enough, clearly. Man, I'd like to 
Get all these guys. Yeah, time pauses uh, during the action commands, which is very nice. Might be able to get this guy. Yeah. Got him. We're good to go. That's better. First attempt, I got one kill. So. Now that that is taken care of, we have, well, we already had enough funds, but let's head on over to pay the fee. Give in to the man. Yeah, we got some free fight missions there. I'm not going to do them. I mean, you're going to see all the killing you want to see during the actual missions, so pretty much going to ignore those. Unless there's a special one that you guys really want to see. Which would be pretty dumb, because they're like all the same. Oh yeah, and one thing I just want to show now, even though it has no practical purpose anymore, um, is the training dojo over here. I know you want that, right? Yeah, in a fresh game, there'd be training here. Oh, I haven't done these. Cool. Then I'll get to demonstrate them. Anyway, the music here is clearly an homage to Eye of the Tiger, which I think is pretty rad. Anyway, uh, the workouts here are basic little things here. Strength training is mashing the A button, because, you know, strength training. You're going to be mashing the A button to kill lots of dudes. And yeah, it's actually kind of a little tough. Be sure to rest properly. Again, you people who can actually beat Canary Mary and Clyde Cuckoo Land will not have trouble with this, but, you know, I'm having trouble. And also, mashing buttons is a lot harder on a Wii controller than a standard controller. I don't really know why, I just always have trouble. Come on. There we go. Yeah, my, my thumb like freezes up there. And then we can also do the squat. This is a lot easier. Yeah, just do this a lot. Get into the proper rhythm, and it's no problem. And then there's also a barbell thing, or dumbbell, rather. And that's literally just lifting. It's, it's really not worth seeing. Anyway, see ya, Thunder Ryu. Yeah, you can see my health got a little better there. I actually did not realize that I had not done that. So, cool, yeah. Whoops. Sorry about that, Mr. Car, who was undamaged. It's not a commentary on how dangerous bikes can be. Anyway, let's just finagle around here.
and there's the ATM. Dash on over, we really don't need the Shrill Tiger for this. And I'll see you guys next time for number eight.